Look at the towers, man. They look so sick. Yeah. We're at the crypt, baby. We're at the crypt. Oh, after, after, after. Yes, yes. Yeah. Kobe! We're here at the motherfucking Clippers game. We're not even at the Lakers game. That is later this week. But listen, we got a little device right here. We got a pen by our side. It should be a great time. It should be a great game. What do you think? It's going to be amazing. It's going to be a crazy match. It's probably going to be like 140 to 135. Damn, he's going yeah. a crazy One, score. Yeah. I'm down for like a little high score, maybe a little OT kind of vibe. I just know my mind's going to be on overtime for sure. I'm going to be fucking blitz. Oh, yeah. What's up, man? You know we're just fucking moving, brother. You know we're coming now. Dak Prescott out here. <laughs> That's <been> awesome. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. What's up, man? Okay, <laughs> Hey, <laughs> Yeah. Come on, huge That was my first ever shot. What? 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 I'm fucking hammered already. Got the little sweet vibe going. You know what it is. Hey, you know exactly what it is. I don't even need to tell you twice. We got a little device right here, an X Max Starry. Listen, man, I'm not a big dry herb vape fan, all right? But if I'm gonna use one, it's because I need to be discreet. I need to save a little bit of bud and I need to chill a little bit. And that's exactly what this device is, bro. Look at that. Ridiculous. Crazy Dude, little like camera. Six, six, oh, straight six. What is that? I don't even know it's what the fuck. It's a DJI Osmo, bro. You use this shit? What the fuck? Bro, it's a that? crazy little bro, camera. It's the fucking Tracks your fucking face. Oh, it's crazy, bro. Flip the camera. Ridiculous, bro. Crazy little zoom on it. Crazy little zoom on it. They're not putting their hands on it. They're gonna stop putting their hands on this. <laughs> She's cooking, baby. We're cooking. You can't go in here! Leave me! Leave me Nah, just inhale, my friend. Just a soft inhale. You just taste some bud, you know? Just some big bud. Good designs going on. Hey, look at that. Grinders being cooked up, man. We are in the Cubist warehouse right now. Just uh, cooking up some ideas, cooking up some grinders, cooking up some motherfucking, you know, just some, just some things for the people. If you don't know, these are the same grinders that I've been using for four or five years. I've never, ever even just wanted to use another one. I know flour mills are really big right now, you know? So I've been trying to get on the flour mill grind, trying to find the best mill kind of grinder. But I don't know, these are kind of it, bro. I fucking love them. Look at the color design that we're always working with as well. Like we're always trying to change up. This was like the first one, you know what I mean? A very bright, vibrant purple, looks great. But then this one is just another level of vibrant. You know what I mean? Yeah, the game was actually really, really motherfucking fun. Nothing like sneaking one of these in. I snuck this in, because they're being super strict, by the way. They're like, what is this, questioning me? I'm so glad that they did not open this bad boy. But easy way to get in through this is that the USB-C right here, I just took a USB-C to phone cord, and I said it was a portable charger, and they didn't even look at it twice after that. So that's the way to do it. That's the way to sneak it into arenas and venues and everything like that. So. Um, yeah, I mean, they're cool. Dry herb vapes are pretty cool, don't get me wrong. But I think I'm, I, I think I just rather prefer a cart. But there are some people 100% who like don't trust carts or you can't get reliable carts or you can't, there's just something about concentrate that you're not really fucking with. I know people who are flower heads only. In that case, something like this does make a little bit of sense. Let's fucking rock it out for another. I think this has 10 minute intervals or something like that. Yeah, look at that right there, bro. Ridiculous, it starts cooking up. But at the end of the day, this does have to heat up. 
you do have to pack a certain amount of it. There's like a lot of downsides to taking this out and about. You know, you're gonna have to have a packet of bud with you damn near. So I think if you can get them, right? If you can go to a dispensary, if you know what kind of carts you're getting, I don't think there's anything that beats a cart in terms of convenience and just terms of like, I wanna get high as fuck right now. I can see that I can see the argument for drier vapes and such though. But um hey, the double boop, boop. big warehouse. Oh my god. <coughs> In terms of clouds as well. There's nothing like some clouds, all right? A lot of people say, you know, clouds don't get you higher. I don't think they get you higher. I don't think vapor production really means anything. <coughs> but it feels cool. It's just it's a little fucking cool sometimes when you blow out a big motherfucking cloud. Don't lie. Been smoking weed for however many years. It's still pretty cool when you get a big cloud out, all right? Don't lie. I was not expecting to get all that. Maybe you just couldn't see the smoke in the venue or in the stadium. I feel like this was not smoking like this. What the? This was definitely not smoking like this in the stadium. I'm tripping. Damn, this shit's tasting good. For 10 straight minutes, too. All right. It's cooler than I thought. This little thing, this X Max Starry 4. I don't think I got a discount code or anything. I don't even know where to buy this. Like, I'm not even trolling, but... Yeah, the engine in the middle instead of uh, behind the wheels. Six, it? it is a flat six still, but it's just not as fucking thick. They just didn't want the GT3 to be overshadowed because they think a lot of people will like this instead because of where the engine is. And it's a lot cheaper than a GT3. Ooh <coughs> I honestly feel like I'm almost like dry herb vape ignorant. Like I know they're super popular. I get asked about them all the time, but I don't know about too many. Like I know the desktop ones. I know the Volcano people fuck with a lot. I know um, there's just certain brands that people fuck with a lot, but I really only know one or two. So let me know in the comments right now if there's a dry herb vape that you actually recommend, if there's one that you want to see a review on, if there's one that you think is better than the rest or is hyped up more than the rest. I know everyone loves the packs. I know when that came out, that was like the iPhone of vapes and everything. Um, and I've definitely seen a lot of devices with like a swivel little mouthpiece like this and everything This thing's well built bro. That's the one thing about dryer vapes that I actually do like I think they're consistently the well the most well-made products in the industry Like a lot of these e-rigs are kind of plasticky a lot of pens batteries are kind of sketch But like these are always heavy as fuck and made of crazy materials and everything So yeah, let me know. I know they're super popular for me personally Like I said, I think I just run with pens man. I don't really think that I, I see too many scenarios in which I run around with one of these things, but maybe I'm gonna make a video soon, like are dry herb vapes worth it? And do a complete overview on them because I need to be a little bit more educated on them. So let me know in the comments. That's gonna be it for today. I love you guys so much. Uh, we got more sporting games soon, man. The crypto is lit all this week. I'm gonna go to a hockey game for the first time tomorrow. My first ever hockey game is gonna be an LA Kings playoff game. So I'm down for that. We got Clippers and Mavericks later. I think the Lakers are getting swept today. So I think that's it for my king. LeBron is my king, so. This makes me sad. Um, that's gonna be it for me. I love you guys. Thanks for chilling. Thanks for being here. Let's see if this thing has any more smoke inside of it. Let's see. Oh. <clears throat> it had a little bit. Let's get a little pen rip in. Also, I, they definitely, I don't wanna say they don't get me as baked. They get me as medicated, if that makes sense. Like, w one bowl of this gets me how I'm supposed to be feeling, I guess, but like, you can keep going off of a pen. You know what I mean? Like, oh, that pen rip didn't really hit me. Let me take five fucking more. You can't really do that with a dryer vape. But um, hey, I guess this video is dryer vapes versus pens or something like that. Love you guys. Cheers. Have a good one. I'll see you in the next one. We've been grinding. We've been uploading this month, bro. 420 or like April might have been my busiest month in a long ass time. But it means a lot that you guys watch and um, fucking... I don't know, show a lot of love. It means a lot, bro. I'm fucking living my life, dreams out here, and it's all because of you. And just remember that you can do the same thing, too. Look at that car back there, that GT4. That's been my dream car for a while. And I know I'm going to get it on some, like, no cocky shit or anything, or not even, like, on some corny, like, manifestation. I just know one day I'm going to get one. You know what I mean? And I know one day you're going to get your dream car, dream house, dream girl, dream fucking job. Cheers. I love you. Make sure you stay safe, stay hungry, and stay horny. I'll see you guys soon. Say hi. <coughs> <coughs> Love you.